Hello everybody, welcome back to another Bakugan unboxing video. Today we'll be looking at the Bakugan Evolution's Mythic Battle Pack. Have a look at the front, have a look at the back. So what's included is 2 git cards, 6 character cards and 12 Baku cores. Have a look at the Baku in case you're interested. Okay, so this is a Mythic Battle Pack. Mythics, from what we knew earlier in the year, were semi-translucent reprints of Bakugan uh, Battle Planet uh, molds. But here, they included Mythic Battle Packs as in the normal opaque uh, Bakugan from Battle Planet. But they are now in Bakugan Evolution colors. Instead of uh, being translucent, they are now opaque. So as you can see that this uh, actually has some misprints inside. Pharaoh is the wrong color. Uh, Pegatrix is also in the wrong color. Yeah, as you can see from the back, all of them are supposed to be in the Bakugan Evolutions color. You can tell this is the Bakugan Evolutions color. It's a lighter blue for the horn. So for this pack, I actually have two misprints. But I do have uh, the Pharaoh for the Bakugan Evolutions colors because I unbox him in another uh, unboxing. I don't have this, so I might have to get this pack again. See how it goes. Have a look at the top, the side, the other side, and the bottom again. Okay, so without further ado, let's open this up. The back quite, looks quite nice. That's a lot of calls, shop calls, customer service card, the checklist. Okay, we have two gate cards. What did we get? Ooh, it's nice. This is a new card. Year 4 gate 38, 600, 100, 100, 600, 100, 100, and a helix. Drago, sitting in lava. And we have year 4 gate 12, 100, 600, 100, 100, 100, and 600 with a helix. Nilius. Yeah, this looks nice. Okay, and we have six character cards. Mythic Drago. So, I believe this is the same as the Mythic that came with the translucent Bakugan. Uh, I think it's the same card. So let me take a Dragonoid, 604, double Flaming Fist, reroll and take a call for your opponent on Flaming Fist. We have Mythic Hydras, double Green Fist, 306, reroll, steal a call from your opponent on Green Fist. Mythic Trox, double Shield, 702, was still missing the symbol here. Uh, reroll, get a call from the field on a shield. Mythic Nilius, double Helix, 606, reroll, plus a call from the field on Helix. Mythic Pegatrix, double magic shield, 505, we roll, take a call from your opponent on magic shield, and Pharaoh. Pharaoh doesn't have a mythic because he's not from Battle Planet, I guess. Double shield, 505. You can tell it's the AV card. Okay, the mythic cards, and the cores, a lot of cores. Plus 300B, plus 300B, plus 150, plus 1, plus 500, plus 250, plus 3, plus 150, plus 1. Plus 150 plus 4, plus 600 minus 3, plus 600 minus 3 again, plus 500, plus 200, and plus 200. Okay, a lot of calls. Okay, let's start. So, this is the new Mythic Battle Pack. For Mythics, we used to associate with the translucent versions. This is the opaque versions, but it's in Bakula Evolution's colors. So, this is the Battle Planet Moves. Looking quite nice actually. Okay, so how do I close him? The usual. And tail up. Okay. This, I think they sort of fixed the horn problem. Uh, the horn problem is fixed, finally. One, two, three, brown. Okay, so for Mythix, it's actually uh, came looking like this earlier in the year. It's a translucent color. This one looks more like the original uh, Battle Planet mold colors. Of course, we can also compare with the original Battle Planet more. Okay. Totally different color. Actually, these frames look very nice. Cool. So, okay, next, next we let's take a look at trucks. So we have many of these trucks so far. This is the Bakugan Evolutions colors. Hands are manual. There's an accent to the the hands and toes. This is darker color. The new Bakugan Evolutions colors are growing on me actually. I quite like them now. When they first came out, it wasn't that uh, appealing to me. Okay, so how do we close it? Hands in, legs up, head back, close to tail. Two, three, bra. Oh, flew up. Remember the hands are manual. 
Earlier in the year, we have the Mythic Shocks, which is this translucent version. It's much closer to the original colors. Oh, the magnet is quite weak. Can't even stick it to the card. Yeah, I just hold it like that. Okay, you can see the difference between the colors for Mythic and the Vulcan Evolutions. Okay, and also original uh, colors from Battle Planet. They inverted the colors. Okay, you can see the colors, they've been, been inverted. Okay, so this is uh, the new Mythic Trucks from Vulcan Evolutions. Up here. Okay, so our first misprint of the set, which is uh, Pegatrix from Battle Planet. This is the Japanese version. So this is the Battle Planet version. So from what I saw from the box, it has the lighter bluish horns and yellow eyes. It's not the same. So there is a version that is Vulcan Evolutions colors. Yeah, if I ever get it in the future, I will I'll do an update video for this. Anyway, this is the original. Yeah, and of course, if you want to see, this is the mythic, mythic version. Looks like a diamond, but not a diamond. Kind of a foggy color. Okay, next we have Hydras. Actually, the Hydras in Buckner Evolution's colors looks quite nice. Yeah, how do we close him? Remember feet are manual. These two back feet are manual. How do we close him? Legs up, feet in, and close. One, two, three, bra. One, two, three, bra. One, two, three, bra. Okay, so this is uh, Aquas Hydrus. Mythic Aquas Hydrus. The other Mythic Aquas Hydrus is this. Very, very dark blue in color. You can see the difference between the two Mythics. Okay, and of course, this is the Yellow Planet version. Looking very different, the two blues are really very different. Okay, so Hydras. Okay, our next misprint of the pack. This is uh, this should have been Aurelus Pharaoh, but it's in Darkest Armor Alliance version. I do have the uh, the one that's supposed to be included, which is this. This is the Buckland Evolutions colors. I unboxed it in another box. Okay, let's see how it opens. One, two, three, bro. So very bright as per Buckland Evolutions colors. There was no mythic, uh, translucent mythic for this previously, so hence there was no cut as well. As you can see, there's no cut. For the older version, uh, I haven't unboxed it yet because I'm an alliance. Yeah, but you can see it from here. This is the uh, Pharaoh. Color looks like this. Different type of color, the Aurelus colors. Okay, so unfortunately, this one I'll just put it back here. Okay, last but not least, we have Nilius, our favorite Nilius. I have so many Niliuses. So many, so many Niliuses. For Nilius, this is the Buckland Evolutions colors. Looking quite nice actually with all these silver accents. I'm gonna transform him. Close and close. One, two, three, bro. Okay, so Metic Nilius. And we also have Metic Nilius. It's a translucent version. Kept the green accents from the Buckland Battle Planet version. Okay, so this is the translucent mythic, and this is the original Battle Planet version. From the front, you can't really tell the difference, except for this. This was green at the front, so it's three different shades of colors. Okay, the back looks like this. Okay, so other Niliuses. Strange they didn't have Hellcore, it's always Nilius instead of Hellcore. Anyway, this is Nilius, mythic Nilius. So this has been my unboxing of the Mythic Battle Pack. What did we get with this set? We have these two gate cards. We have Mythic Dragonoid. Mythic Hydras. Mythic Trox. Mythic Nilius. Mythic Pegatrix. And Pharaoh. So this has been my unboxing video for today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this content, please click the like button and subscribe. See you next video. Thanks. Bye.